Weathertop is where Strider, at the time, before he is known as Aragorn, and the hobbits, as he's taking them to Rivendell, travel up to the top of this old sort of castle ruin. Uh, action! Nothing! We found a location, a brilliant location, is it like a mushroom uh, rock that's about 300 feet high, and it has a top piece of grass that goes out to these limestone edges and then just drops off. And then in underneath, there was a hollow on each side. And so we have Weathertop Hollow, uh, where they light the little fire, and then we created a staircase running up inside that rock to the Weathertop Summit. Just touch in on a couple of statues, as if they're just isolated pops on statues that don't necessarily whip on or whip off, although you could put those in as well. We've added these uh, statues, which they're not complete yet. They're going to be more broken down than they're appearing at the moment. You take out a sliver like that, take out a wedge. When the face goes back in, yeah. it will kind of swing back in that way. The figures were sculpted by um, one of our very talented sculptors. And she made small maquettes from drawings that I'd done. You just watch the work. It's going now. But as a sculptor, she's probably not the person to be actually attacking them and aging them down. So, um, so we have to be very, very careful in sort of not knocking off the best bits. <laughs> Push it that way. I guess they just sort of represent some element of the age of this place, but they're also kind of like a brooding presence, a kind of foreboding of what's about to happen. It's extremely frightening because it's the first time that the, the hobbits, you know, had been attacked by the ringwraiths. The first thing you see is how scared Frodo is, and then you turn and look, and at that point, I think we go to fireways. Awesome. and action! So we're all armed, and by this point, we realise that it's Frodo that they want, so the hobbits are in a formation where they're protecting Frodo. Just need you circling around amongst yourselves a little bit more, guys. If you just, yeah, that, that sort of feel. Uh, yeah. One, one more. They're in deep, deep trouble when they get up the top. It was really spooky to sort of be in that environment. Really a hollow, vacant, eerie, scary quality to the way that was described in the books and the way Peter has actualized it in the film. Just react with your sword arm. Just, yeah. All righty, lighting up the torch then. Wind and smoke happening, please. Shooting now, Johnny Mark. The whole set says this is, this is not a place you really want to be. You know?